This is the magnificent royal chateau of Angers in my native region of Anjou in the Loire Valley. What a joy it is for me to be back at the large Saturday farmer's market. The local white asparagus, shallots and lamb lettuce are well-known specialties, while the strawberries taste as delicious as in my youth. The Anjou region produces some of France's best value wines. The star made with white grape is Chenin Blanc that the rest of the world has a difficulty to match in finesse. This is the beautiful Chenin Blanc, the wine of my youth. I can't visit Angers without tasting the chocolate specialty of Kernon d'Ardoise. Made with toffee hazelnuts and almonds, coated with white chocolate, colored in blue, to look like the local elegant roof slates. Crunchy caramelized nuts covered with chocolate. Heaven. This strawberry tart with pistachio nuts is so fine. I first rolled out some sweet pastry. Line a lift out flan tin with the pastry, top with foil and pastry weight to prevent the pastry from shrinking. I like to bake it in the oven at 180 degrees for about 20 minutes. I next make a crème chantilly by beating one tablespoon of Cointreau, 30 ml of milk and 300 ml of crème fraîche until light. And mix in two tablespoons of icing sugar. I carefully spread this chantilly cream over the cool pastry shell and top generously with strawberry halves and brush the berries lightly with apricot jam. It is now fashionable to sprinkle chopped pistachio nuts around the edge. Here is one of the most popular French desserts, tarte aux fraises et aux pistaches. The beautiful and world-famous liqueur of Cointreau was created and is made in the city of Angers. I have enjoyed the orange liqueur from this iconic bottle all my life and used it in many desserts, so I am thrilled to finally visit the distillery with my host, Corinne Lava. So Cointreau is made of the distillation of both sweet and bitter orange peel. This is what brings to Cointreau this perfect balance. Uh, you can drink it either neat, on ice, or on cocktails. I love the idea of learning to make simple, no fuss, refreshing cocktails. Maud, my cocktail teacher, fills three glasses with ice, adds 50 ml of Cointreau, and tops with a little sparkling water and the juice of half a lime. This makes a delicious, fruity, and zesty base. One cocktail is flavored with two slices of cucumber and a crushed basil leaf. The next with the pulp of half a passion fruit and three little pieces of ginger. And the third with strawberry pieces and crushed mint. I love them all, they're all very delicious, but because we're in Anjou, my choice goes for the strawberry and mint. That is good. Tomorrow we arrive in the attractive city of Limoges, famous for its great beef and porcelain. <laughs>